Double. Dragon. It's your boy A Man. It's like him. Back with some new heat for y'all today. Like I never left. You heard what she said. Get it, man. Can't yeah, just thought of an idea, but okay. Yeah, man, we back. Tokyo Revengers, another episode. Facts. Heat, heat, heat. Tokyo. Uh, we had the uh, third divisional captain, Kisaki, pop up. Yeah. So it means we couldn't really stop that from happening. That was to me. That was the original goal. Don't let them meet. That was the original goal. Don't let these two meet. Right. But of course, we have to save, you know what I'm saying? A lot of people, you know what I'm saying? I felt like we truly saved. I don't know. Now that I think about it, if you really think deep down, he didn't save nobody. Because. He saved Draken, cool. I don't think so. Draken was on death row. Oh, you talking about in the future? Yeah, he was on death row. That and because... he was still being controlled by Kisaki, so it was like he wasn't really living. Like, he wasn't really living. And yeah. Kisaki came, came like, he probably enjoying more days, like, before Kisaki just, but before he sees who who Kisaki was. But I feel like after that, it's just darkness. Same way with, um, same way with, same way with Akun. Because, you know, some people just be... When they in those type of situations, they kind of consider like fit themselves dead already in a sense, being controlled and and like you, you know what I'm saying. So like different, like it's like you live. Man's on death row. Really... He ain't got no family. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. But I think with the uh, like the plot is more so like they free having everybody. Huh? I think it's freeing everybody. It's freeing, but ain't nobody really safe. Ain't supposed to be safe right now because like we got to the point where we did everything we need to do to make it good. Yep. So like, technically so nobody gotta die. safe. Yeah, man. Then we got the other the other new dude who was technically the sixth founding member, possibly founding member of uh, Toman yeah. that we don't know about. And uh, I guess he had a close relationship with um, Baji. Baji. Yeah. yeah. Baji pulled up cold though. When he when he first pulled up, Baji. Yeah. Oh, when they was fighting and mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, yeah. He pulled up cold and then it's Mobius. And then um, uh, what's the name? Had punched uh punched Kisaki. I didn't expect that. Yeah, Takamichi. I didn't expect him to punch him. I didn't expect that. I didn't expect that either. But that I would have snaked him. I would have just sniped him or something later on a couple days. <laughs> Yeah, but Mikey Kuhn, he listened to Takamichi, man. Takamichi was like, man, I want him out. He's like, all right, prove to me you worth more than him, then I'll do it. He's like, okay, cool. So it's like it went all about strength, because we know one-on-one -on -one that Kasaki beat Takamichi. It was just yeah. like... And, and like, Mikey not just saying this for no reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah so. Yeah. I'm excited, man. Get back into this shit, isn't it? Same here. You ready to run it up? Let's get it. Tap dancing shoes. They gotta be a sensitive spot to have on your neck, fam. Does Mike even go to school, fam? Right? <laughs> You'll see a lot of classroom stuff. I remember those days. You see the girls in the hallway. <laughs> That's tough. No. Press the pink target. Only cool encyclopedia. No, not chop. Hey, we only got a hundred people or a hundred and five. He says it's gonna be a test on this. Mm -hmm. He know more about Toba than Takamichi. <laughs> Leak with the encyclopedia. <laughs> That's 50 feet half the day, thing. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. 
the battle of A3. Wow. Uh. Oh, you looking for talking me, T? Dang. Dang, that, that is him. I think Boz, he was talking to somebody with a tattoo on their neck, mm -hmm. right? Dang. You can tell by their shoe colors? He's going to come in right as they talk about it. He about to get his butt mop. I'm actually your senpai. I'll be smiling. Hey man, what the frick? Just a Koha. Not me, fam. Not me. Ah, shoot. I didn't think. Oh. Mm. Going to the enemy base. Ain't here know where the base is at, too. But that might be a setup, too, though. But hey, I know where the base is at, but it might not be the base. Mm. I feel like this is worse than the other one. You actually got to see it. Yeah. Hey, his homie was with it, though. Mm -hmm. He came in. He's like, hey, man, we don't know you, fam. Hey, he at day school. Oh, he's taking classes from Juvie. Because of him. I wonder if he's talking about Mikey. What if he don't like Kasaki either? Every time you talk about him, everybody always talking about Kasaki. The headless angel. Well, you gotta be on call, bruh. You in the game? It's like, alright, man. Time to fight. But like, oh my gosh. Eating dinner. God dang. Somebody getting mopped? Somebody getting either brought in or just getting beat up. That's Baji. Dang, he already he already changed his. He still got on. his jacket on. Toma jacket. Oh, did he bring him so he can beat him up? Who is he beating up? First division vice captain. That's that was his vice captain. He beating up his own vice captain. So he just brought he just brought him food pretty much. God dang, bruh. Is this that worth it? How am I there? Oh, that's his test of faith. <laughs> they started that chat quick. Somebody was like, let me see it, man. Mm-hmm. I lie. I'm like, he said he was gonna be a spy. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, dumb, bro. You gotta think, bro. Kill Mikey? You see how they jackets say Team Walhalla? Walhalla. Somebody got the foo foos on, fam. <laughs> That's the sixth person. That's the backstory. But he was harboring this for so long? Why are you now deciding to leave? He was 12 right now? Dang! Why'd you decide to fight some punks? 
He made me do all the work. Oh, yeah, yeah, older. Jackie. <laughs> yeah, yeah, older. <laughs> Man, tell this stuff up. Why didn't you just ask him, can you take this picture for us? They beat him up and made him take the picture. It's over. Oh, oh, it's, been oh. it's been a minute, fam. It's been a minute since I got hit with this, bro. Ah, oh, it's over, bro. Golly. It's been a minute since I got hit like that. I ain't felt like that since Demon Slayer, fam. They on some bull, bro. <laughs> Dang. I'm just gonna close the episode like that. And we get some story, man. Katsutora, Baji. Hey, two founder members left Tobin? Pie in prison. Mm -hmm. I have three left. I wanna say it's gonna be kinda similar to Pa and Pei. Whatever the other, uh, the person that was under Pa, that was, was right hand yeah, man. Yeah. I feel like that was kind of um, the same, same relationship that this katsu yeah, whatever kaz and um and uh baji i feel like it's the same like 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 damn bro you just forgot about him or like you banished him and stuff and he was like one of the founding members so mm. he probably been either trying to fix it or been harboring that that feeling because the dude the, the, the dude said he was in juvie so that mean he probably could have just got out he was like hey bro we're bringing him back and then mikey probably was like nah or like Probably mm. just like you know what I'm saying shunned it off because he didn't include him into the into the original founding founding people when he was talking to Mikey. Something. I mean talking to uh, Takamichi. Yeah. So it, he could have just got a juvie. And it's crazy though, because it's hard for me to believe that people would want to like turn it back on Mikey because he's such a like stand up leader. Yeah. And he always fought the team. Like even when stuff happened, he always willing to fight. He was willing to not let Pa go to prison. That's why him and Jack had the little fallout. Like, maybe he acted like that with Pa because he didn't act like that for, for the other guy. That could be a thing too. But it's like, Mikey's like, it's hard for me to believe that uh, like he ain't gonna be doing nothing wrong. Like he just be chill. It gotta be a reason Mikey don't like mess with this guy. They oh, I know that. I know that's a reason. But I'm just saying, like, I don't know what's going on. Like, like what could my, like them do? Like Mikey could, I'm, I'm trying to see what Mikey could do to make them like just be like bro i want to leave i don't like but i feel like it had to do with how he was treated and how he probably was like kicked out of toma yeah i think that's kind of what it is it's crazy though like mikey and, and dragon goon bro them niggas cool as heck yeah but if but like you know these kids is, is, is yeah. like mischief you know like they oh, bad yeah. as hell so it'd be like he was like, bro, we all can't go down for your efforts, bro. You out here yeah. shanking people, then you out here doing whatever you want to do. Like y'all bad, bro. Y'all ain't got no sense of order, which is why y'all not in these in these uh in these positions of power, of course. Yeah. Cause y'all bad as hell. I definitely want to see the reason, man. They left off on the cliffhanger, which is dope. I don't know how you gonna get Baji back. I don't, I don't see it, bro. Yeah, he got he might have to get mocked. They making it tough. Even Mikey can say he's always been a problem child. We seen that in the flashback too. I don't know how this about to happen. So Mike's gonna have to pop up and be like, get you in the car. Get in the car. Then he beat up his first division uh vice captain. I'm glad, I'm glad we didn't get to know him. Because I would have been kind of salty. Like, dang, bro, why you gotta beat my man's up? I'm I'm so glad that he didn't like we don't know who that guy is. I feel like it would have been a better it would it, it would have hit more yeah, had we known who that was. I'd have been like, like no, bro. you beating him up. I feel like it would have hit more, so so y'all slipped on that one. But y'all doing good though. Y'all doing a good job though. That's crazy though. To, even they was like, bro, he's been by your side forever. Beating yeah. him up. Yeah, I don't know, man. It's wild. I don't know. They brought Takamichi there, but the witness. A, a witness and stuff. And... Ah, this is about to be wild. First, I was thinking Valhalla was like an already like established thing. So 300 members. They got a lot of people. Well, oh, I thought it was but, like yeah, it's like them people broken up. Yeah. Together. Yeah, like they broke up and came together, but it's like because homie got out of jail, but I don't know. Yeah, it's kind of like Mobius people and yeah, it's yeah. a mixture. 
It's a lot going on, man. I'm excited to unravel more of this story, but it's a dope episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure y'all take these videos out. We're not Patreon before we put them on YouTube. Facts. Double checking out. Peace. Peace.